Hey everybody, Crypto Mentor 99 how you doing? So I got to tell you about my Ethiopian lunch that I had today. Have some friends from Ethiopia and they're like, hey, come on over for lunch. So Mrs. Crypto Mentor 99 and I drove over there for lunch and it was so interesting. Now, before I get into the lunch, Whenever I visit other countries, it's always a great honor for me to go into someone's home, especially when I'm in another country. But even here in the United States, there's just something special being in someone's home, sharing a meal. So we go over to their house and I'm a little bit familiar with the Ethiopian cuisine, a little bit, not a whole lot, but a little bit. So we go over there and we started to eat and there was a beautiful bowl of beets, B-E-E-T-S, beautiful bowl of beets. And then there was cabbage and carrots in another bowl cooked. Then there was lentils in a third bowl. The fourth bowl was kale. And the last bowl on the end was meat and before we started, there was this like pancake, but it was about that thick. It wasn't a pancake. It was like square that you put at the bottom of your plate. And then you put the lentils or the kale or the, you know, cabbage and carrots on top. And then you kind of ate with your hands. So that was a new experience for me. Um, I can't say I've ever eaten an Ethiopian lunch with my fingers, but I did today. But at the end, I did ask for a fork and a knife because I wanted to eat faster. But it was so good. And again, just a random video. I love to meet people from other countries. I love to talk to people from other countries. And again, I love lentils, love kale, beets. I ate a few, but Beets aren't my favorite, but I wanted to try everything. And definitely the carrots, cabbage, and there was some onions. So if you know any Ethiopian meals that I should be eating and adding to my Ethiopian lunch menu or dinner menu, let me know. My email address is CryptoMentor99 at Yahoo.com, CryptoMentor99 at yahoo.com. Again, if you have any Ethiopian recipes, this little guy would love to hear from you. And um, then I'll do a food review on it. Anyhow, thanks for being a part of my crypto family. Love y'all. Bye-bye.